BB, I'm afraid I have a devastating dilemma for you. I'm currently house-sitting for my parents whilst they're away on holiday for a week. On the first night, after a few glasses of wine, I got under the bed to plug my phone charger into the wall. There I found a very pretty shoebox. Oh, no, don't look in the shoebox under the bed. Oh, I don't even know if I can read this. Why would you bloody look? <laughs> Why? Imagine my shock as I opened it to find my mother's very large and realistic battery-powered boyfriend. Hindsight is great, and I know now that I should have left it there, but my curiosity would unfortunately get the better of me. Being alone and horny, and also quite impressed by the XL veiny monster no. I had in my hands... No, no, no. Oh, no! No, 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 no. she did not use her mum's dildo. That's nasty. Tell me, uh, That's nasty. Tell me. Well, please. Please. People are disgusting. That's she nasty. I gave it a wash, turned it on, and slipped it in. Oh, So not God. Into too much detail. All I'll say is the beast was amazing. It hit all the right spots. Upon closer in... Oh, no! It gets worse! How can oh, it get worse? How does it get worse? She's using her mum's dildo, for Christ's sake. No! <laughs> how does it get... What? How does it get worse? How does it get worse? The only markings were a faint name on the base embossed in the plastic. It read, Clone a Willy. Oh, no. Turns out I've been getting the best orgasms of my life from a replica of my father's penis. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. to proceed from here? Bruh. What done? What's your advice regards Melissa? It's been a great five years. <laughs> This is it. We've peaked. I'm going to go ahead and just light it up. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and light it up, bro. There is... That is... First off, using your mother's dildo is nasty. Using your mother's dildo that's a replica of your father's penis. That sound like some... Final Destination shit. <laughs> oh, that sounds like some Final Destination shit, bro. Mm. And don't sleep. Don't sleep. It's a lot of y'all out here whose girls own dildos, man. You feel what I'm saying? I came across my girl's um, toy. I came across my girl's toy, bro. With my wife's toy. I didn't know how to feel about it. Because. You know. I, it's like I don't have a problem with you having a toy. Right. But when I'm thinking about it. It's a replica of a real. Of a real penis. Right. Okay. So if I. If I'm you know. If, Somebody is spiritually in my wife. That that's how I, it's a thing that I've never met that she have never met. But they made a, a copy of his and now he's banging my wife in spirit. What's up, mommy? Uh, uh, Mia Moore. Uh, follow us a number. Uh, um, Mia Moore Marcus. Uh, they done the edits. Caught the henna? Okay. Yeah, what's up? Oh, yeah. Text me. Hey, bro. I've heard, I've heard a lot of Spanish, and I don't know if all them words go together. He was just saying shit. <laughs> Yo, he was just saying stuff, bro. I don't know if all them words go together, but I mean, you know, that's 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 how it's going down in Colombia and these other places now. Dudes go out there. They go. They go on sneaker shopping, pretty much. 
They going sneaker shopping pretty much. That's crazy. I saw the comments. You read the comments. You're responding to the comments because you don't have anything better to do with your time but respond to comments under my video. You know, I was hoping to get to know you a little bit on here. The way okay. we've gotten to know each other off camera. And I see what you're doing. I see what you're doing. Yeah. Yeah. So You want to seem cool. You're like, oh, I want, I want my people to think, what do you call them? Goblins. Did you come up with that? Mm -hmm. And they just went along with it. Mm hmm Okay. Uh, you Do you have, have a fan army name? No. Okay. You would know that because you stalk me in your free time. Mm -hmm. You don't have to ask a question. You know the answer to. Okay. Do you have anything else to yeah, talk have, about? I had questions to ask about. Did you write them down? No. I remember my stuff. Okay. Congratulations. You've been doing this for a lot longer. You're much older than me. I'm 23. You're not 23. He's 23. I think we went over this when we did my podcast. You're when like, you, what? You had all my information wrong when you thought you knew where I was from and who I was dating and how much money I had and what car I drove and my age, and it was all off. Okay. It's not my fault that no one actually cares enough to get that information right about you. Jesus Christ, you're such a f What did I just watch? I... Is that her thing? Like, she invites people to her podcast and insult them? Oh, wow. I hate to be in some situation like this, dog. I'm going to be real with you. They still in black and mild. They still in blunt raps. They still in blunt raps. Time out. Yo, did y'all see my man pull the two... He pulled the two. He, <laughs> he been waiting for this all his life. He been waiting for this moment all his life, bro. Look at that. Bro. I be so... Worried about being this man walked in there with slides on, bro. But I be so worried about stuff like this happening to me. You know what I'm saying? Especially like in Atlanta, they carjack people a lot. And you know, I got a challenger. They I mean I got a little V six, so ain't nobody really checking for no V six. But at the same time, bro, like I be thinking about that shit. Like, damn. If somebody run down on me and try to carjack me right now, like what would I do? How how would I maneuver? Even though I be having my gun on me all the time, that don't mean shit, bro. Like when they come in to carjack you, it happens like this. When they come in to rob you, it happens like this. There's no you're not gonna have a John Wick moment. You're not gonna have a a, a Bruce Willis and Die Hard moment. It's it's not going down like that, bro. Give it up. You just got to hope that whoever's trying to rob you is not so antsy and accidentally pull the trigger and kill you. Because a lot of these dudes, they have no trigger discipline. They have no trigger discipline. That's a sad situation, man. But anyway, that is today's video. Um, I might upload this one pretty late today. But I appreciate you guys for watching my videos. I appreciate the people who will follow me on Instagram. I appreciate all the comments. I can't even speak. Sorry, my mouth was kind of dry. I appreciate all the comments, man. I appreciate all the support. All right? Squad.